Hello reInvent 2022, my name is Calvin Hendricks Parker and I am joined today by Matt Coulter. Uh, Matt, give us a quick introduction, who are you? Yeah, so if you don't know of me, my name is Matt Coulter. I am a senior architect in Liberty Mutual, as well as the founder of CDK Day, the writer of the CDK book, and oh, yes. the founder of the Belfast Meetup. So what do you do in your spare time? <laughs> I sleep, that's what I do. <laughs> awesome, no, we, we actually got to see you on stage last year at reInvent, it was, oh. pretty, <laughs> it was pretty cool, right? Oh. I mean, that was pretty awesome to get there with Werner. So this year, what have you uh, heard, what announcements have gotten you excited? So I think the uh, Code Catalyst that they launched today was pretty cool. So it's like a similar idea to what we have in Liberty Mutual where any developer can come along, find a pre-established pattern, yeah. pick it up and it'll set up your code bases, build pipeline, and then you're ready to go to production. Yeah. And I think it's awesome that that's now commoditized and we can like shift left. I, I do like that aspect of, we're gonna give you everything from the CICD pipelines to the, the serverless components that may make up this typical pattern of things. I assume you'll be able to make your own patterns and just publish your own libraries of them. Yeah, like I, I hope that's the way it goes because that's what yeah. we have and it's like, yeah. you get this, we call it like a flywheel of innovation yeah. because it just keeps going around circular. Yep, no, that's awesome. So looking forward in time, going home from reInvent, what are you hoping to take home with you? Um, so the, uh, the thing I'll actually take home is the other announcement, which was EventBridge pipes. Yeah. Because this is awesome where EventBridge <laughs> can like directly just pipe data into any of the other services, which means we can delete so many Lambda functions that we're just taking stuff from EventBridge and setting in another service. Yeah. This, this seems like something that should have existed from the beginning. Yes. I mean, especially given the Unix philosophy that you know, Werner talked about on stage, that you know, have a simple API for what goes in and a simple API for what goes out, yeah. Yeah. Why, why didn't we have this before? I know, and then when you combine EventBridge with step functions now, yeah. the sheer power we've got from serverless orchestration and choreography is just amazing. Yeah, and enabling the right kind of patterns too. Yeah. I mean, he really talked about and emphasized that in the keynote, like decoupling of those services so they can have their own release cycles and everything. I think that was a good message to send to the developers of the world. Yeah, like we've now hit the point where I was actually talking to a colleague yesterday about a long running process. It's a yeah. four hour process and they put it in a container. And I was like, hey, you know, step functions, event bridge, because the tools are now sitting there that yeah. we can do these things. Yeah, that's awesome. Th Matt, thanks so much for being with me and uh, hanging out here in the Hero Lounge. Uh, reInvent, we will see you uh, in a little bit. Yeah, thank you.